Well, trying to solve the many homicides that take place in our region is a huge challenge for police. And for the families, the waiting and wondering just adds to the pain. New at 10, Fox 2's Martin Kilcoin tells us about a former sports department intern who lost his father to senseless violence. Just from the start, he, he just wanted to make sure that he was in my life and, and he was raising me. Daryl Richardson was a Navy veteran and he had plans for his son. They involved education. Growing up, he was strict and, and I had to, you know, every night come home and, and do my homework right away. And if I had a, a B plus or anything, my dad was gonna be up there talking to the teachers. My dad, he harassed the front offices at MIT uh, over me not getting into a summer program, and then the next year I was in their summer program, and then the following year I was accepted into MIT. Darius was the only child of Daryl and Sharon Richardson. He took his dad's challenge and got good grades, went to Stanford, got a degree in mechanical engineering, and then a master's in aeronautical engineering. Martin, he loves Stanford. He loved it. I'd tell everybody, you know, I, I wear Stanford gear, but my dad loved Stanford. He had everything. He had Stanford hats, Stanford sweatpants. Uh, he was up there all the time. Uh, part of his deal was I could go, you know, all the way to the edge of, of California, but he could come whenever he wanted, and so he sure did. This summer, on a Friday, July 24th, Darius's dad ran out on an errand, but never returned. I got a call from a detective, and he said, hey, Mr. Richardson, I'd like to come talk to you, and... You know, it, it's it's just like the movies. When you get those calls, it's never good. And uh, and I asked him then. I said, well, you know, can you just tell me everything's okay? And he said, I, I can't do that for you. And so I go down to the police station, and he tells me, uh, you know, I I have reason to believe that there was a homicide, and the the victim is your father. But seeing you now, he's he said, I know that it's your father. Daryl Richardson was murdered, sitting inside his car on North Grand shot to death around 7 o'clock at night. Police believe it was an attempted carjacking. The simple fact is these people were, were robbing my dad. Um, and he was an older guy. He had just had back surgery, not, I don't know, maybe six months prior. And so he, he was no physical threat to anybody. It's been four months and police are still working the case. They have some suspects in mind, but could use help from the public. It was still daylight and there were witnesses in the area. I don't know if, if it's the not knowing what went down or, or the who did it part. Honestly, the, the biggest part for me is the idea of the fact that there are people who did this and they just haven't had any consequences for it. There's days where it's, it's anger, it's, it's um, you know, sadness, missing, missing my, my best friend, um, missing, you know, just being able to, just being able to ask him for advice about things. The stories have been pouring in and many have a similar theme. The dad who pushed his son, wanted his son to succeed in life, had been bragging about that son for years. After he passed, the number of people who came up to me and told me about how he just gushed about me all the time, uh, it was, it, it really, it, it, it warmed my heart to, to see people reach out and tell me those stories. Martin Kilcoin, Fox 2 News. Dale Richardson was 66 at the time of his death. And again, police have suspects in mind, but they're asking for your help as they believe there are several witnesses to the murder. Call Crime Stoppers if you know anything.